Well, much is evolving with polycythemia vera in 2015. One, it's been definitively uh, identified that it is a malignancy. It's very mutation-driven with changes in the JAK-STAT pathway. With that, we have both revised the diagnostic criteria for this disease, with the WHO criteria coming out, as well as better understanding the burden for patients and the symptom burden. Now, the therapeutic management of patients with polycythemia vera is evolving. Historically, people really think about it in terms of aspirin, the use of phlebotomy, and use of hydroxyurea. Now, there really are several agents which are important in the management of this disease. First, ruxolitinib, which has been approved as a second-line therapy for patients with polycythemia vera who have really had an inadequate response to hydroxyurea, whether that because of resistance or intolerance. 